action. The Nazi party came to America to study racial discrimination, took those ideas back to Germany and turned it up on the Jew, not the other way around. After World War II, the United States of America in 1948, it created a nation for the Jewish person called Israel. What does the black person get for discrimination in America? The Native American, they got reservations. The Jewish person, they got a nation. And black people in America, we got incarceration. My father was born in a segregated hospital. Do you think he was born in a segregated hospital because black people said, we don't want to be around those white folks? My father went to segregated schools. Did he go to all black schools because black people said, we don't want to be around those white folks? There has always been a history in America of anti-black ideology. I need my fellow Americans to acknowledge the discrimination that happened to black people in America that still persists to this day. America loves the immigrant. America loves the foreigner and hates the black man. There are 7.5 million Jews in America. There are 44 million black folks in America. Guess what? There are 44 million immigrants in America. Both of those groups of people have more political power in America than black people. Why is that? Is that because black people don't want to participate in our political system? Is that because black people don't want to have any economic power? Or have we been systematically discriminated against in America because of anti-black ideology? Can we have honest conversations instead of trying to demonize black people in America because of the discrimination that we faced in America? If we want to push America forward, then we have to acknowledge the sins of America. I don't have any animosity towards a white person, but I understand the history of America. I know what it takes to move America forward. White people and black people have to work together. The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive. The greatest American alive.